Hello and welcome. My name is Matthias. You're watching Dope or No, where I try to find the absolute worst product on the internet as the foremost product reviewer on this platform. Don't watch anyone else. Let's get into it. <laughs> this is a royalty free banger, dude. Today, we're gonna have Bailey join us. Bailey has found a significant amount of these products. I have found some of these products, and you know what? Tanner has also found some of these products. May he rest in peace. This is what you call a uh, sports tournament bracket. Yeah, I know uh, even less about this. I'm a man. <laughs> but these products are going head to head to see what is the worst product on the internet, and the winner goes right there as the worst first product. <laughs> okay, this is the one that I found. This one I'm so excited for. A $60 Epozoe automatic bed robot sweeping robot smart bed robot. Good helper for travel, lightweight and convenient. You're taking this to travel? I'm not gonna sleep in a crummy bed this time, but I'm still gonna pay $29.99 per night because I have standards. <laughs> oh, anti-fall technology. I have that. Good. I don't have anti-fall technology. Remember how I fell down those stairs? Bailey literally just told me five seconds before we started recording that she fell down the stairs earlier. I fell up those same stairs like a couple days ago. I was just running up the stairs. Why are you running? What do you have to, what do, you have to do? Were you running away from someone? No. There's just... No, you were running away from someone. Yes, sympathy, sympathy vote. Yeah. Away. Whoa! Yeah. That's crazy. My arch nemesis. Now it's becoming unbelievable again. <laughs> <laughs> what exactly does it do? Vacuum sanitize? Might want to add to your description if you want a buyers. That's a great remark. <laughs> That's a great remark, all right? But keep it to yourself. I saw this item on an invention show, so I knew that it was supposed to be sanitizing. Oh, it's not a vacuum? I'm so sad. I wanted it to clean crumbs. It sanitizes using ultraviolet lights. That's what that little tube was. Fascinating. Add to cart. Okay, it came in a nondescript box. Ah, here's the other box. Wireless is convenient. It's just a general <laughs> statement. Wireless is convenient, okay? This isn't wireless, but it would be convenient if it was. Slim body, wish I had that. Intelligent anti-drop sensor, intelligent anti-collision sensor, low working noise. This is a real thing that actually came. I really didn't think it was gonna come. Oh, there it is. So that's ultraviolet light right there. So that sanitizes. It already doesn't have an anti-collision sensor. It's really trying, dude. It's like, I'll get through! This is a pretty well-made bed. Let us sanitize it. <laughs> that it did not like. It was like, in bed? No, we're not gonna do that. Oh, what? Oh, it, it didn't fall off. It's really like in this one spot, though. I'm gonna put you under there. It doesn't want to go under, dude. Oh, now he's exploring. Oh, that's so weird. Bro, you got that spot. How do you know there's not so many fun germs for you down there? Do you just do this then? Yeah, now he's like, okay, this is fun. And there's really nothing else to this. I really wish this picked up crumbs. Don't you dare fall off. Oh, no! Did not live up to the hype. This is so dumb. This is a definite nope. It's a definite nope. But... Will it beat out the next product? Tater mitts. The quick potato peeling gloves, fast and easy to use, peels the thinnest layer of potato skin. This is so strange. Just peels potato skins. Magic. Was this review helpful? No. <laughs> Sorry, dude, but you're not helpful. Let's add to cart. Tater mitt. Tater. Oh, it's just a bunch of hard stuff. <laughs> it's That's like it. cat litter. <laughs> so I'm assuming that I need water though. This is just an assumption. As someone who's done a few potato skins, basically this stuff's not gonna come off unless it's softened. But these are not oiled, so they're not gonna work. It kinda works. But if it was boiled, it'd probably actually work. Yeah! Woo! Yay, yay! Whoa. Wow, it actually works pretty well. Oh, gross. Respect to all you potato peelers out there, because I love my fries. Yeah, so if this was boiled, these would for sure work, which means these are not as bad as the robot vacuum, which means this robot vacuum wins as the worst between those two. Next product, yee yee. Link, plug, and walk. 
What does that mean? Link is the answer. Slippery in wet conditions? Sweaty feet? Not really. Give up on your flip flops and select a new walking experience. Okay, let's watch this ad. Imagine wearing a watch without a wristband. Backpack with no straps. Why not the good old flip flops only this time? with no straps. Is that supposed to help me understand your product? I was gonna say like, what is this solving? It doesn't solve it. <laughs> if anything, all it did was glorify straps. <laughs> the comfort style I love that just the like, the they really could have gotten this shot maybe like 20 minutes earlier. <laughs> ice cream oh. is just absolutely, <laughs> the director's like, let's do it again. I don't have much ice cream left, again. They're not really stylish. Bro, who has that much trouble with flip-flops? I like never, I wear flip-flops and I love them. Wow, these look stupid. Let's just do it, add to cart. Now, I hope you got my size, Bailey. What's my size? 11 and Yeah. Wow, that's big. Is that my size? These are heavy, dude. These look like they'd be so uncomfortable. Are they, no, these are not my size. What size are <laughs> These are 13 and a half, dude. So I, I think I remember these. We had these in stock because Woods did a yes. short and but Tanner wore them. Size? I don't Tanner's, know, dude. There's no way Tanner's. He's not. And Woods and is just the doofus when he buys products. <laughs> Woods, what's the matter with you, dude? I'll try to pretend like they're my size. I won't give bad ratings because they fall off. Yeah, these would these would definitely stay on my feet, but they're like not comfortable and they just look stupid. They look like I'm I stepped in a bucket and the bucket caught on my foot. What problem is this solving? They said. Straps. Yeah. I never thought it was a problem. This is pretty stupid. Sorry, uh, Link. You're gonna have to try a little harder to get me to click your link. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this product that Link is up against is the new LCD screen smart trendy headphones. So I found these. There is an LCD screen on the side of it. Who's that for? Can't be for the person wearing them. It looks like you're listening to a banger right now. <laughs> what you see is what you get. Premium headphone matches premium quality. I'm gonna be honest with you. I didn't see premium when I looked at this. How much are they? 40 bucks. Oh, that's not bad. Add to cart. <laughs> Wow, my own pair of nuckies. Lots of features. Call reminder. Can't call, but you can get reminded that you need to take a call. <laughs> Honestly, a nice case. This is solving such a unique problem though. The problem that it's trying to solve is like, you don't want to bring your phone around. So this has storage on it for you to load music on? Yeah, you can put like an SD card on it and stuff. And there's already some songs on it. This is what the creators of Nucky listen to. Honestly, they don't sound bad. <laughs> this is a royalty free banger, dude. <laughs> From far away, they're just dark. Are they dark? They're not even on. Can you tell I'm listening to a royalty-free banger right now? I love this track, They went dude. away again. What? The bars went away again. The bars went away? No one's gonna know! They're not touchscreens, though. So what's the point? I still have to navigate just using these buttons, which defeats the whole purpose of these whole entire things. I'm gonna say <laughs> Nuckies should get nuked. Nuckies, you are now competing with the robot back. Dog slings. What's wrong with letting the dog just walk? They're animals. They're filthy animals. This dog's so cute. You know, this dog does look old. So maybe that's why. It's for old dogs. You know, usually when a dog gets old, you take it out back. No. You think they made dog slings 100 years ago? They were just like, take Jocko out back. No, mom. We got to eat tonight, don't we? Fine. Add to cart on the dog sling. Here he goes, the dog sling, and guess what? Special guest star, Bailey, Bailey. and not this Bailey, that Bailey. Dope her up. Smells a little, but she's adorable. Hey, she smells clean. Bailey, sit. She cleans the dog and smell, I suppose. Oh my word, you're so you cute. Oh, thank you. That's very good. Do you want to wear this? Or do you trust me with your-, I, do, I your... trust you. I wouldn't. How is the dog supposed to go in there? You stuff it. But like, <laughs> <gasps> she's so warm. How does that feel, Bailey? <laughs> <laughs> Where's my lavender latte? I knew that she would be okay in it, but she's vibing. Look she at likes her. It. What about jogging? I don't know. <laughs> oh, Generally, if something can walk, I'm like, use your feet. Call my kids, Daddy, can you hold me? What's wrong with your legs? Well, nothing. Okay. <laughs> There you go, that's, cool. that's very good. That's cool. Do you want her to say if it's a dope or an ope or not? Oh, she didn't like it. Speak. I don't know, maybe this is a nope. Yeah. This is a long review. She's like, what you put me She's through? Like, All the stuff, and now you're asking me to speak on top of it? Round of applause for Bailey. A round of applause for Bailey. Yay. 
<laughs> so I don't know, dude. I I say no. Nope. Natural peanut butter mixer. This is the stupidest. This is so stupid. I don't, what is this? This is this woman using a drill. Get a fork. You're already in workout gear. Make it a workout. Am I wrong? Attach it to your favorite electric power drill. I have a favorite power drill. Do you? Oh yeah. It's my trusty sidekick. When I get home, put it in the holster. Oh, yo. Oh. Oh. Thighs thick as peanut butter. That's the shirt he's wearing. Hey, look, why don't you keep your peanut butter yourself, weirdo? Add a cart. <laughs> You know, sometimes you like get a, a taste of your legacy. You know, some of you guys are accountants. Some of you guys are like architects. People ask me, what do you do? Just watch, just watch this video where I mix peanut butter and you get paid for that? Sure do. <gasps> I bent that. I barely did it. That could have taken really? an eye out, yeah. What a way to go out, huh? Yeah, <laughs> nut buster. How'd he die? He got killed by the nut buster. <gasps> Oh! This drill doesn't have... This drill doesn't have, like, the sensitivity needed. I'm barely tapping it. <gasps> I'm so frustrated by this. Here's another unmixed jar, and here is a slightly clean knife. You just kind of have to work it in the top, and then I'm done. <laughs> I'm honestly done. Yeah, you can get it more, but like who cares that much? You're gonna eat it. It's all going in the same place. Yeah. That product just made me angry. So I'm gonna say this one definitely is the loser and the winner at the same time. Right there. Mini rolling vacuum robot cleaner. Cute automatic floor sweeping robot microfiber ball. Look, this is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. I can't, I don't have enough time and energy for this. And it's just like. So the way this thing cleans is by rolling around. Someone spent time making this. Is there a strategy to this or just a roll around? You have to go get it. So stupid, dude. Stupid. I can't believe these people bought it. It's a joke. It's a joke. Don't waste your money. It doesn't do anything except roll a few times. What did you think it was going to do? All it could possibly do is roll. That's all it's gonna do. How did they think it was gonna suck me I had to get that out. How did they even get here? Like, how did you get here? I'm not an alien, what do you mean? How did I get here? I drove. What are you talking about? <laughs> Why are we here? How did you get here? That's the question I have. We all kind of think you're a little bit of an alien, but now we're a new one. Yeah, I'm a little, a little more suspicious. How did it get here? How did you get here? I mean, how did you I got here it? the same way all the other humans did, Bailey. How did you find this product is what I mean. Bro, I'm a professional product hunter. That's what I do, Bailey. Add to cart. Microfiber mop ball. I love the little stars around them. They're so cute. You would think they're cute. They're little aliens! They're small little aliens! All you need to do is clean the furry cover and then let the ball do the rest. Here we go. I was really working on that one spot. Oh, it really, it found it, it found something. You're done? All this? You're not even rolling! This is a cat toy remarketed as a vacuum cleaner. Hey Bailey, I got something special for you. You're gonna love this. Bailey, get it off. <laughs> she doesn't like it. Watch, you, the minute you put it down and it moves by itself, she's like, yo. I wanna go get a real tennis ball and just show the comparison. We'll be right back. <laughs> After these messages from our sponsor. Myself! Do you guys know we have a Discord? <laughs> no, seriously, it's super fun. We're actually super active on it. Got awesome mods, got a great community. Super fun, so check that out. Bailey's back. See, like, she knows that this is- Oh, there it is, there it is! Wow, she's locked on. Do you want the ball? She sure does. Ready, and she's go so get it! <laughs> okay, that's a nope. That's stupid. We hate it. All of us. Including Bailey. So this product has some backstory. I found this product a year ago. Their faces are just the best meme content ever. My wife's like, we're gonna have pizza tonight. I send her this one. My wife's like, ah, oh, they're out of pizza. I send her that one. My wife's like, how you doing today? I'm like, I'm hanging in there. She's like, how you feeling today? Uh, I know you didn't sleep well. I send her this one. He's just living his best life. $399 for that. Wow, let's add to cart because this is just too funny. The first one is upright. Hands in here, right? Bro, this kind of hurts. What is this supposed to do? This hurts. Okay, what's the next one? 
you. Oh goodness. Hold up, what? <laughs> Bro, are you gonna pull something just getting into this? Ow! Ah! Lift, lift. Yeah! Whoa! Take the pick, quick. No! <laughs> Bro, this is a torture device for the people that want back injuries, not for the people that have back injuries. What a mess that is, dude. That's a definite nope. <laughs> I gotta be honest with you, the ball is absolutely a worse product because it's got no use. It was just something that Woods made. The scruffy leg shaver, neck shaver. I can shave my neck? I'm gonna try and shave my neck. It feels like this would take more time to would. like set up, perfect, and get right. It worked and it only took five minutes on both legs. How long does it take you to shave your legs? I was gonna say like five minutes okay, probably. Okay, that's what I thought. Yeah. Like, you know, you've been doing it for what, 10 years? Yeah, Right. I, I was bullied into shaving my legs. So it's been longer than- Let's unpack that later. Add to cart. Not bad packaging. One scruffy and five blades. Our story, here we go. Okay, so it was designed for the back of the neck. I'm like, there's no way men designed this to solve a lady problem. Generally, men don't think like that. They think, <laughs> yeah. what problems can I solve for me? Thank you for believing in our vision. I haven't yet, okay? You got a good neck shot there? Do I have hair there? Not much? Dang it. I don't use shaving cream now. I'm a real man. You know, shaving cream, like, who cares? Just cut yourself a little. How do I do this? <gasps> It's so funny though. I think I got it. Go higher. Go yeah, higher? Go higher. Yeah, there you go. Supposed to go down. <gasps> I feel it. Did it do anything? <gasps> it really did. Does it look better than it did before? I mean, it's, you know, you definitely cleaned it up. If I had my shirt off, you know, like when you're shaving, right? I'll probably be able to get a little bit more detail, but I'm gonna be honest with you. I might actually even keep that. I was gonna say, I, have, I had a feeling you were gonna say that. I might even keep that, guys. So I'm gonna say that's a dope, surprisingly. <laughs> Unprecedented. Oh, simulation. Balthine and the most gigantious stuffed plush toy. Our isopod versus real isopod. Psh, real isopods suck. Am I right? It's like, remember that one time I had lice? I really want a plushie to commemorate it. Best co pilot. This person put a seatbelt on him. This person can drive. Add to cart. Oh, it really is vacuum packed, dude. <laughs> Poor little guy, suffocating in there. What is that? It's his like little mouth. Ah, it just gives me such weird vibes. Just gotta like bring it to life, you know? That actually worked. Every part of him is disturbing. Oh, there's little teeth. There's not much else I can say other than like, it's really weird. Since this actually worked, it's gotta be the isopod that, that keeps going. Here we go, guys. Isopod. Boom. Next product. The brow. I've actually seen this before. They're like sunglasses without being sunglasses. So I'm a little confused though. What's wrong with wearing sunglasses? They all look mad, but they're smiling. They look like they're going, oh, don't put it on kids. Don't bring kids into this. They're innocent. They're harmless. Add to cart. <laughs> Interesting. Sent us two. Maybe it wasn't an accident. We gotta get rid of this stuff. <laughs> it's not selling. Give two to every person that buys one. This is a fun little case. You'd think without having the lenses in them, it'd be more portable, but this feels more difficult to carry than glasses. Yeah. Ow! <laughs> what, I'm not angry. I'm not angry! They actually kind of fit on you. Stop. They do. Oh, you're saying I'm one of them. <laughs> I know. That's the meanest thing you've ever said to me. Let's go outside. Good for you! Yeah. I just look like an idiot though. It's definitely getting more than what a hat would just because it's closer to my eyes. But I also can't see up into the sky. If a bird was coming at me, I wouldn't know. And that happens. I've seen it. Is it as good as just sunglasses? Oh, these are way worse. <laughs> these sunglasses suck so much. It works, it's just stupid. There's nothing else to it. HD day and night visor. This feels like I'm reading some sort of like PDF. Your grandfather tries to send you a product. He's like, did you check this out? It's like a PDF. And you're like, how'd you even do this? <laughs> it's the only visor that blocks glare during the day and at night. Why would you need to block glare at night? Oh, okay, for oncoming cars. I might have to use these at night. I might have to drive home with this. Why? Did you say why? <laughs> <laughs> because. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> 
You just never know what Bailey's gonna say. You just never know. Why? I, I, I guess I, don't, I guess she got me. I, I don't know, dude. True glare protection, not just tinted plastic. Now it makes me feel like it's just tinted plastic. Let's add the cart. They sent it in this weird pink? Congratulations, you're having a girl! The idea here is you put this on your sun visor. You take off this little protective film here. Oh, come on. I can't stand that. Cause then like it gets stuck in there and you never can like, oh, what a pet peeve of mine. My life's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Look at, I put his flap onto his head and he looks like a little babushka. What? Doesn't he look like a babushka? <laughs> She's so proud of that. Okay, so this is so you can still see during the day. This next one, you put that up and then you can see at night. What if I do both? It's like day and night vision. You can see <laughs> through the see future. It. Let's put it on the car. All right, so um, this product's a nope. No, I'm just kidding. I actually have one right here. There you go. That's that. During the day, what? This is like such a mess to do while driving. So that's daytime. No, it makes it more difficult to just like feels like more stuff in the way if someone was in front of me i might have hit them straight up it's so difficult to see through this when the sun is going directly at it it's such a distraction because it doesn't work perfectly with my existing thing it's just all around dangerous for me at least <laughs> okay i i got some lights on can you even see what i'm doing here what i'm here we go i'm using this thing you can't see what i'm doing here it's too dark this right here you can't really you can't tell this is the mat oh. It just came off. Either way, it makes no difference. If anything, it's harder to see through. So, this sucks. This one's a real hard one. I'm gonna have to say, the brow. The brow's dumber. And now I have to rate these. Now it's between the dumb robot vac or the, I liked the music that it came with. It was banger royalty free. I think this is stupider. I really do. I think this is dumb. Really dumb. Okay, so we're gonna put this one right there. The peanut butter was annoying, super annoying, gross. This is just even just more stupid. It's just like they are trying to be self-aware stupid, but are stupid. That's just lack of self-awareness stupid. So we're gonna go with that one, dumber. Okay, between these two, you know, that's just a stuffed animal, right? The brow's dumber. The brow is dumber. For the ultimate winner, <laughs> this one, this is tough. This actually has some utility. These just don't work at all. This one has a UV light, it doesn't work. This one, this one just made me beyond angry. I got it. It's gonna be this one. That's the dumbest product on the internet. And that is an official review. Matt, I have something for you. No. Yes, I do. No. I present you with <gasps> the best worst product reviewer award. It's time. I told you, mom. I told you. I'm gonna put this right here. That's, that's my legacy right there. All right, guys, that's it for me. You got the worst product on the internet. If you are unsure if that's the worst product on the internet, you can verify that by just buying it. All links down in the description below. Try to prove me wrong, jerk. I am the best re of reviewer of the worst. That's me, me. I'm the best of the worst. Me.